Greetings to all my tech heads out there in the Kev Techify Nation. And if you're new here, welcome. In this episode, we're going to look at networks and how they affect our lives. We'll be discussing how networks connect us and also the evolving no boundaries network. This episode is part of my series on introduction to networks. I'm Kevin here at Kev Techify. Let's get this adventure started. Networks are very important in our lives. Not only can they be from the IT perspective, but think about all the other networks we have. We have the road system that helps us get in from point to point. We have the water system, the electricity system. They all help us function in our daily lives. We have our network of friends and family we talk with and we visit. We have networks at, at work, people we know who we can get in contact and look at stuff. All these networks are important. In this course, we're gonna be looking at IT networks and specifically how do we design them, how do they function and that type of stuff. Now, one of the ideas here is networks don't have boundaries. Prior to networks, there was boundaries. Countries had boundaries, states had boundaries. We were bound by oceans, by rivers, by lakes, by latitudes, longitudes. We were bound by lines drawn in the sand and that's where a lot of the stuff. Now with the IT networks, these, net, these boundaries don't exist. We continually go on and we start seeing that these boundaries just don't matter anymore. And so that's what we're looking at. Some of the things I'd like you to think about is what would we have without the internet? Think about your life without the internet today. Even if we keep computer networks, we didn't have the internet, what would that do? That would eliminate all social media, which some will argue that's a good thing. Then we would have the ability to work remotely. That would not be there. And so what would your world look like? Now, another thing to think about as we get into here, what will be the possible, what will be possible in the future? What different types of networks will evolve? Right now, today, we have our wired networks, we have our fiber optic networks, we have wireless networks. In the future, what else are we going to have? What will we be able to do with those networks? So let's think about that. Now, the, going back to the idea of no boundaries, world without boundaries, global communications, one of the terms Cisco likes to use is this human network, where the, it's a network of humans and the, and the IT network just helps facilitates that network. It was my pleasure to bring you this wonderful episode on how networks affect our lives. If you like this episode and you got value out of it, and depending upon what platform you're using, please click that like button, give a five star rating, leave a comment. This all helps me bring you more great content. Please take a minute to subscribe to my channel. All my socials and contact information are on my website, kevtechify.com, and you can get all these episodes in video and podcast form. In the upper right is my playlist for my series on introduction to networks. In the bottom right is one of my favorite videos that I linked just for you. Thank you so much for watching this episode on my series on introduction to networks. Once again, I'm Kevin. This is Kev Techify. I'll see you next time for another great adventure.